day traders seek to make money from short-term swings up and down in the markets. Being able to identify beforehand when commodity futures, stocks, or foreign currencies may be especially volatile gives the day trader a big advantage. Fortunately, there are recurring events such as scheduled economic reports that the trader can take advantage of. You can find the dates and times for these reports on various economic calendars. The role of economic calendars in day trading is to alert day traders as to trading opportunities. It is the job of the day trader to competently read the indicators and chart patterns that tend to be affected by these events. As always, discipline in following a trading strategy and knowing when to trade and when to avoid a potentially dangerous market are keys to success. Introduction to Economic Calendars Day trading of commodity futures, foreign currencies, or stocks does not occur in a vacuum. There are real-world events and relevant data that drive prices. When economic indicators such as the rate of inflation, employment, and unemployment numbers, or the ISM Manufacturing Index, are in the run-up to the release of data, markets rise or fall on expectations and tend to correct after data is released. Foreign currency traders often need to pay attention to economic calendars for both nations whose currencies they trade. When day trading commodity futures, reports relating to production, crop forecasts, and world economies are all important to follow. Key Economic Indicators to Watch Key economic indicators regarding the economy and markets in general include the Consumer Price Index, non-farm payroll, and Federal Reserve Open Market Committee meetings, where interest rates are determined. If you are day trading currencies, such as the dollar versus the euro, you need to also follow the same reports for the European Union. Those who trade futures on a commodity such as crude oil may want to mark their calendars for reports like the OPEC crude oil production, Saudi Arabia, and U.S. crude oil field production numbers. How to use economic calendars to plan trades. Now that you have marked your calendar for those reports that may be important to your day trading, what do you do next? The point of this exercise is to know when there may be useful day trading opportunities. Market activity commonly may begin at least a few days before a report is available. Here is where the day trader will need to decide if the market is reacting rationally to what a report may show, discounting it and pushing prices downward, or getting overly excited and driving prices much higher than the market will eventually support. The old saying in this last case is to buy on the rumor and sell on the news, or release. Using charts and technical indicators, the disciplined day trader enters, manages, and exits trades as the market they are trading moves up or down. An important caveat here is that while day trading in the days and even hours both before and after the release of an economic report can be quite profitable. Remaining in a trade in the period of time immediately before, during, and after a report is released can be extremely risky and should be avoided. Managing risk around economic events. As a general rule, the more volatile the market, the more profit potential it holds, and the greater risk of loss. Successful day traders track economic events in order to anticipate when volatility may occur. Disciplined day traders develop strategies that repeatedly return profits in these situations and always avoid being in a market when risk is excessive. A successful day trader is also one who always sets their stop loss and take profit points with every trade and limits their position sizes according to potential risk. Selecting the best economic calendar for your trading needs. There are lots of economic news releases. Fortunately, the day trader does not need to keep track of each and every one individually. There are information sources to go to. For example, the Bloomberg economic calendar provided by investing.com lets the day trader set the time frame for reports and even the country or countries of interest. The trading economics calendar lets you set the time frame for just today, this week, this month, next week, or month. 
for previous weeks or months. It also allows one to filter by country or category such as Baker Hughes oil rig counts in the energy sector or Japanese household spending in the consumer confidence category. As a rule, day traders need to set filters for information that is useful to their specific areas of trading and avoid information overload by trying to follow too many reports and then missing the important parts. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to download the free training guides in the description below.